of matters with Sterling Machinery Exchange. We've been buying and selling new and used machinery, such as press brakes, mills, grinders, lathes, saws, shears, and much more since 1954. Today we've got a special treat for you. We have a lot of machines in stock here at one time. Today we're going to show you our two most popular milling machines that we do sell here. They're both made by the same company, by Acra Machinery. They've been around a very, very long time. They have a great name in the business. Uh, we're going to show you the difference between the two. There's a few thousand dollars difference, but there's just a few uh, other simple differences that you might want to know about that you don't get to see when you see all these other machines out there because they are side by side here. So we'll go ahead. We'll start with this one right here. This is the AM2V uh, vertical milling machine by Acra. Uh, you'll notice it's got a variable speed head. Uh, there's a few things that you might want to look at. The shape of the head you'll notice is a kind of a, uh, a square rectangular type head as opposed to this is the LMC50. Now this has the bridge port style head. This is going to be almost as close as you can get to a bridge port as you can get. And they're pretty much the fathers of this machine. Another nice thing to look at is you're going to notice this actually has heat, uh, heated and chrome ways, chrome ground, uh, so it's going to last a nice long time. This is going to be more of a, uh, a, a great maintenance machine, a uh, machine in a shop that's not doing full production every day that you're not maybe working really heavy on. Uh, you'll notice on here the table size is going to be very similar to this other one, uh, but if you look closely at the table, we'll take a close look at this table, it's just going to have the normal... Uh, table that you'd see. On this one you're going to see all these little scraping marks. And what these do is it really uh, allows for the oil to have even distribution across this table as well as the ways. You'll notice here these are chromed and scraped ways on the front as well as on the back. So the knee also has the same thing. What that's going to do is on this LMC50 it's going to give you a lot longer life due to that and you'll notice that it, the table will basically last as long as you keep the chips out of it. It does have the chip covers as well as the AM2. Um, these ways are going to stay in really, really pristine condition due to the scraping. And as well as this one, it's going to have the chrome so it's still going to be a lot heavier duty than some of the lesser mills. Some of the lesser mills from China, uh, there's other ones from Taiwan. They pretty much come from everywhere in the world now. Uh, but the Taiwan ones are, are known as the best ones out there. They've been doing it probably the longest, and uh, they've, they've gotten some pretty good quality. Uh, the digital readouts, power feeds, power draw bars, power feeds on the knee and on the Y. We can do all that for you here on any of our machines. We can customize them for you. You'll notice we have a lot of different machines here, uh, new and used, so you can see all the different types when you come here at Sterling. This is actually our chip making showroom. We have a large machinery showroom just down the street. What we're going to do now, we're going to run the machine, let you hear the differences. So you're going to change your speeds right here to standard variable speed mill. Right now we've got the uh, power feed on, you'll notice that, and we'll put the power feed on. This will come down, of course, to wherever we set this depth stop. Once it hits the depth stop, it'll return back up. Do that again without me pulling on it. Here's your forward and reverse right here for your feed. And you'll notice it went right back up. So what that does is every time you're going to be able to go ahead, set your table in the position you need, and once the drill goes down, you'll know you're going to be at that same depth every time. It's really easy just to go across the board and do all the drill holes you might need. Show you that one more time. Of course, this is a brand new machine. The head sounds excellent. This is their best model that they do make. So it's going to be having the nicest parts around and have, have really good bearings in it. All the parts are really easy to get on these machines as well. Both of these Acra machines use parts that are available on the market. Uh, not only for Acra, but a lot of other machines actually do fit these. In fact, this one right here, most of these parts I bet you would almost be the same as a Bridgeport machine. That's really what they were copying off of for this LMC50. So you can see all the way through that speed range, very, very quiet. We'll turn it off, hit the brake. We'll 
change the speeds here from high to low. Now we're in our high range of the speeds here. Right there is at the 4200 RPM. And what we'll do is we'll come back to this one. I'll set this one at 4200. That's going to be the max. It's just going to give you a little bit of a uh, understanding of the sound and the speed. So now we've turned this guy on, same variable speed. You'll see here's your speed range, your low and your high, 60 to 485, 500 to 4200. Put the power feed on, forward and reverse on your feed. You'll notice it'll come down now to that same depth stop. And it retracts back up. Once again, same thing with your table. You set it where you need it, you put it right to your depth, and you'll hit that same number each time. This is how you're going to change the speed on this guy. So there's a little more vibration in the head than the other one, of course. Still running high, though. Very nice. We'll stop it, hit the brake. Change gears again to high to low. And right there we're at 4200 RPM. I'm going to turn this other one on right now. My mic right here is on me, so you can hear as close as I'll be. I'll be real quiet for a second. You can hear the two heads. We walk over to the Zacra. So you can see it's very, very similar. They're going to be very similar machines. Just a few options that we showed you are going to make the difference. Turn these guys off. Uh, they both have the one-shot lubes. They've got all the covers for the ways, of course. And depending if you want the digital readouts, power feeds, we can help you out with those. So please give us a call, 626-444-0311. You can check out our website for current inventory of new and used. And yes, we love trade-ins, so let us know what kind of trade-ins you have at sterlingmachinery.com. Thank you. Sterling Machinery sells all types of metalworking, fabricating, and chip making machinery such as lathes, metal shears, press brakes, punch presses, punches, grinders, milling machines, saws, plate rolls, iron workers, inspection equipment, welders, and much more. Sterling Machinery is one of the largest stocking dealers of new and used machine tools in the United States. You can view over 2,000 machine tools available for inspection on our floor or visit www.sterlingmachinery.com to view all machine specifications, photos, videos, prices, and buyer's guides for all types of equipment.
If you can't find the machine you're looking for, please give us a call at 626-444-0311 and our educated staff can find the right machine for you.